What's up, everyone? Jared Sandler here with your 90-ish second Rangers recap after the Rangers fall to the Rockies by a score of 10-6. to The Rangers actually trailing 10-3 to at one point, got the tie-in run of the plate in the ninth inning. Scott Heineman lined out off of Carlos Estevez, who appeared to actually injure himself as he was able to uh, recover and get the final out. But Rangers made it close with some good ninth inning patience, but the real key here in the bottom of the second after Rugnet Odor's two-run home run gave the Rangers a 2-0 lead was Rymel Tapia's at bat against Colby Allard. He kept fouling pitch after pitch after pitch off and ended up seeing 10 pitches before singling the other way. And then the very next man, Ryan McMahon, hit a three-run home run that gave the Rockies the lead. They ended up uh, adding to their lead, taking uh, two more runs across the board in the inning. What's significant beyond just the fact that Tapia saw 10 pitches, he really wore down Allard. So Allard, the rest of the inning, was not pitching on anywhere near a full tank of gas. And the other thing, it was the first left-handed hitter to reach base against Allard all year, and then McMahon, a lefty, hit the home run one batter later. That was really a big turning point in today's game. Again, the Rockies beat the Rangers by a score of 10-6. to